Wow, I love it. All these videos I can actually stand here for hours and watch them. Look at this yellow guy. Hello. Give me a high five. Yeah. Checking out the merchandise. Oh, so cute. This stuff right here. Stockings. Mommy is taking in some of the views from here. Oh, this is beautiful. Oh, what's this? There are some fun stuff for the kids. Can you see there are some small seahorses hiding inside those plants? A plant? Are, are those plants? I don't know. I think kelp or coral. I just saw a huge hanging whale. We are getting into the open sea. Oh my gosh, this is cool. Wow, this is real fish. I think anchovies. Yeah, I think so, anchovies. Silvery. This place is mesmerizing. You look around here and there is something to see everywhere, every corner. We came to this next level viewing area and no way, look at that. Wow, it's so silvery, sun falling on it. And look at all the formations they made. It's, it's unbelievable. Check out these seabirds. Oh, yeah. All these birds we see on the California coast, nesting on the shore. There is a puffin. It looks like they are having fun here. Going to see the Ender Monterey Bay, and there are some telescopes to check out things. Thank you. 
Wow, let's go there. Wow, it's stunning. A ball tank for anchovy fish. Starfish. Look at this cute little guy. Hey, hello. Which are which plants or animals? Looks are deceiving. We got a shrimp on the corner. Hey, buddy. Get closer. See this panel to the pool right here. Wow, this is super big window. Look how small everybody down there. Now you know the size of it. Yeah, and Joey's and the sea of leopard shark. Yeah, a couple of little sharks. Wow, this one is a beast. Yeah, so big. It's a monster. Black clutch. Hey, thank you. This guy just came out to post you for my camera. <laughs> Wow, he's showing off. He got the best view. More sea shark birds. I just feel like I'm underwater. That's this thing.
and return the land as rain and snow, providing most of our food body, from sharks to dolphins, diving seabirds, and even giant whales. I'm more than happy to make a meal out of some anchovies and sardines. such as one of our avicultures, you may learn those based off of that. But Mo and I have another one. You take a look at these penguins' right wings, you're going to see a wingman with their name on it. Easy as that. Because she is feeding out a small schooling fish today. You can take a big additional eyelid to help you see underwater. With the black on the back and the white on the front. And that coloration is actually, believe it or not, a form of camouflage. I am dressed in these coveralls and these very stylish goggles here for a reason to protect me from that penguin superpower, which Ray may or may not use on me here any moment. Uh, we'll keep an eye out there. Yes, that outfit is really tricky away from the party. I mean, you may be asking, you know, like, why is this such a superpower? Where is that going right here? When you see where a penguin is, it's not the best. Now, we've been talking about all these penguins um, as individuals, but they are part of this colony of 20, and this colony of 20 penguins is part of a much larger colony of African penguins found throughout accredited zoos and aquariums across North America. If you look up on the monitor, you are going to see a map of North America and a penguin icon pop up for each one of those institutions that we partner with so that these birds can become part of a species survival camp or SSP. America, but we don't stop there. Your support here is helping us. But it doesn't only tell you their name, but it also tells you who is a male and who is a female. The males will have a white wingband with a black lettering, and the females will have a black wingband with a black lettering. 